Hello, it is me, Chasey Poo, and today is my 10 months post-op, and I thought it was my 9 months post-op until I realized I was last month. I literally cannot believe it's been 10 months. That literally means that in two months it's going to be a year since I had top surgery with Garamoni in Florida. What? So I don't know if any of you watched my videos when I was on T for the first time. I, after a couple of months, the changes like kind of stopped happening. So I kind of just sat in front of the camera and just said, there's no more changes. I feel like I'm at that point with my chest. Um, I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm comfortable enough now that I think I can work out. I might have said that last time, but look, I don't have time. I don't have money to go to the gym. But I feel like if I had the opportunity and time to work out, I would be 100% comfortable now with my chest. Because like I've said in the past, I could literally like... I can sit on my stomach. I can sit on my stomach. <laughs> I can lay on my stomach and sleep. And it feels amazing to be able to do that again because that's how I want, that, that's, that is my preferred method of sleeping. And, um, I don't know. It looks really weird on this couch. I really wanted to do my video in front of the blackboard, but it was Zuja's birthday last week and I wrote happy birthday and I really don't feel like erasing it. Maybe I want to talk about nipple piercings and stuff. I... I'm not really happy with this nipple because it doesn't pop out like this one. But I'm thinking if it's really, if it makes me dysphoric in, I don't know, in a couple of months, um, in a couple of months, more like a year, um, I'll just get a nipple piercing in it, maybe. It's kind of flat, but I'm sure you could figure it out. Oh my god, just imagine the pain of a nipple piercing on this nipple right now. I can't even imagine, but I'm just thinking like, Maybe in two years or something. I was thinking about maybe getting some tattoos around my scars um, to make them not so scarry. <laughs> um, but my scars are like pretty, pretty purple. If um, if you take a look at that, I mean they're not purple, purple, but like they're red, but sometimes they're purple, and sometimes they're really faded in the middle. It's really confusing. I really don't know why it's like that. Uh, I like doing that though because it looks like there's no scars, but I don't know if I would ever get a tattoo. I'd probably maybe like to hide some of it, but I don't know. I kind of like the scars and eventually I'll have more chest hair than I have right now. I don't know if you, let me just, you see, yes you can because it's HD. Look at this. Literally these are like the only chest hairs I have. Eventually, I mean there's some down here in the cleave area, but um, I don't know. Honestly, it's... It's just hilarious to me. So since I have this beautiful camera, I might as well move it while I'm talking so you can hear me moving it. I might as well show you the nip. So this is the nip that I'm not really a fan of all that well. Um, as you can see, it's not, you know, see that it's kind of flat. Oh, there's a little poopy boop. And this is the majestical nip. I have heartburn right now. I don't know why. I don't know why you need it to know that. But see, it like pops out and it's very beauty. Like, look at that nip. Oh, uh, yeah. I wonder if you guys always think I'm naked in my videos. You probably do, huh? This video is like really short because I really don't have anything to say, but that's fine. I like looking at myself in here. It makes my eyes look really blue. Oh, I hope you guys have a great week, and I'll see you next month for this top surgery update thing. And of course, you'll see me like 12 times a week because I make videos even though I have no time. Love you. Boop.